one single yard short. That is how close Ole Miss came to potentially tying the game up in the fourth quarter against 23rd ranked California. After starting quarterback Matt Corral left the game in the fourth due to a rib injury, true freshman QB John Rice Plumley came in for the Rebels, going 7 for 7 for 82 yards and two drives. The last chance efforts from the freshman, though, they wouldn't be enough. Let's get to the game. Last time Ole Miss and Cal met was in 2017, the first time the Golden Bears have ever been to Vaught Hemingway Stadium. First quarter, Cal QB Chase Garbers finds wide receiver Trayvon Clark for a six yard touchdown. Cal goes up 7 0. Still in the first, Ole Miss back on offense. QB Matt Corral on the keeper picks up 21 yards for a first down. That same drive. Corral on the keeper again, this time finding the end zone. Marching in a tie ball game at seven all. Cal driving now. Garbers is sacked by Taquarius Tisdale for an eight yard loss. Throw the fins up, man. The clock winding down in the first corral finds running back Jerry and Ely for a nine yard pickup. Also a first down. The Rabbers kicker Luke Logan comes in to kick a field goal. Ole Miss tacks on and takes the lead 10 to 7. And that, ladies and gentlemen, was a interception by DeAndre Prince. Returns to the Golden Bears 35 for a first down. His first career interception. Logan comes in to kick again. The 33rd yard. 33 yard field goal is good. Ole Miss trails 14 to 13. Same score going into the break coming out of half. Cal puts up two more touchdowns to lead 28 to 13. The third quarter, Garber sacked by Miles Hartsfield for a nine yard loss, but Matt Corral. John Rice Plumley there scrambling out and finds wide receiver Demarcus Gregory in the red zone. The next play that will haunt the Rebels. Plumley to Elijah Moore just a yard short. The clock would wind down. Cal gets the win 28 to 20. Head coach Matt Luke saying he was happy with Plumley's performance, but disappointed in the outcome of the game. We got to look at Matt. I think he's got some ribs. I don't know what the situation is, but we're going to have to evaluate Matt. But obviously, John Rice um, playing that well gives you some confidence. You know, if Matt's not 100%, that he can go in there and perform. I did think at the very least it could have been uh, buzzed and looked at, but we, we didn't have a timeout and didn't couldn't spike it. So the uh, you know our only option was to to do the quarterback sneak and get the ball off. It doesn't even matter anymore. Like I don't. I, it's not that I'm trying to be rude or anything, but the game's over with now and. We got Bama next, and they're a great team, and we got to get ready for them.